In a shocking revelation during his recent interview with The Hollywood Reporter, Johnny Depp laid bare the lengths Meghan Markle went to in her quest for a role in his latest film, Modi, Three Days on the Wing of Madness. The film, released in September 2024 in Italy, has already stirred controversy with its dark themes and complex characters. However, it is Markle's relentless pursuit of the role of Beatrice Hastings that has now taken center stage. Depp disclosed that Markle bombarded him with threatening messages, revealing not only her desperation to be part of the project, but also a sense of entitlement that many have come to associate with the Duchess. As the world watches this unfolding drama, it raises questions about the ethics of celebrity ambition and the lengths to which individuals will go to secure their place in the limelight. Depp's interview took an unexpected turn as he recounted the barrage of messages from Markle. It was as if she believed I owed her the role, he explained. The messages started off as polite requests, but they quickly escalated into demands laced with threats. Depp described how Markle insisted that her inclusion in the film was vital for its success, stating, I can bring an audience like no one else can. You need me. It's a sentiment that echoes throughout Hollywood, where many stars believe their names alone can elevate a project. Yet, in this case, it seems Markle's strategy backfired, alienating the very filmmaker she sought to collaborate with. The character of Beatrice Hastings, a complex figure steeped in intrigue and moral ambiguity, was not something to be taken lightly. Depp, known for his own tumultuous journey in the industry, found it perplexing that Markle would dismiss the gravitas of the role. He remarked, It's not just about the glamour. It's about the soul of the character. Beatrice requires depth and authenticity, qualities that can't be manufactured. This reflection raises an essential debate about the nature of acting and the qualities that truly make a performer great. Markle's insistence on the role seems less about artistic merit and more about personal branding, a narrative that Depp refused to entertain. Depp's revelations have fueled discussions across social media platforms, with fans divided on Markle's intentions. Some defend her right to pursue opportunities in Hollywood, while others criticize her tactics. One user on Twitter encapsulated the sentiment perfectly. Megan needs to learn that talent trumps connections. Threatening Johnny Depp is not the way to win roles. This statement resonates with many who believe that hard work and genuine skill should dictate casting decisions, rather than the celebrity status of an individual. As Depp continued to discuss the unfolding saga, he painted a vivid picture of the Hollywood landscape, where such antics are not only commonplace, but often expected. This industry is a jungle, he said. There are people who will claw their way to the top without a second thought. It's disheartening. His words reflect a deeper disillusionment with the entertainment world, where authenticity is often sacrificed for the sake of fame. Markle's actions appear to embody this troubling trend, where the allure of stardom overshadows the commitment to craft. In the wake of these revelations, Markle has remained silent, a stark contrast to her usual public persona. The Duchess, known for her calculated media appearances and strategic releases, seems to be adopting a different approach this time. Fans have noted her absence from social media discussions regarding Depp's comments, leading many to speculate about the impact of this scandal on her carefully curated image. She's trying to control the narrative, one entertainment insider noted. But it might be too late. The damage is done and the public is starting to see through the facade. The consequences of Markle's behavior extend beyond just her relationship with Depp. The revelation of her threats paints a broader picture of celebrity culture, where ambition can often blur ethical lines. As the world watches, the backlash against Markle is mounting, with many demanding accountability. Depp's decision to speak out against her tactics has opened a floodgate of discussions about integrity in Hollywood. I refuse to be intimidated by anyone, no matter how famous they are, Depp asserted. This sentiment resonates with many in the industry who have experienced similar pressures to conform to the whims of powerful figures. Critics of Markle argue that her actions reveal a troubling pattern of entitlement that has plagued her career since her entry into the royal family. From her public appearances to her interviews, there's a recurring theme of asserting her worth without the accompanying talent. It's as if she believes her title is enough to secure her roles, Depp mused. This statement encapsulates a growing frustration with Markle's approach, 
which many see as a testament to the pitfalls of privilege in the entertainment industry. As the fallout continues, Depp's revelations have sparked a larger conversation about the implications of celebrity culture. What does it mean when individuals feel empowered to threaten others to achieve their goals? How does this behavior reflect on the broader dynamics of power and privilege within Hollywood? These questions linger as the public grapples with the implications of Markle's actions and their potential consequences on her career. The saga of Johnny Depp and Meghan Markle serves as a cautionary tale about the nature of ambition and the ethics of fame. As Markle navigates the aftermath of this controversy, her next moves will be scrutinized more than ever. The world is watching, waiting to see if she will learn from this misstep or continue down a path of entitlement and manipulation. For Depp, speaking out was a necessary step in reclaiming his narrative, reminding the world that true talent and integrity cannot be threatened or bought. As the drama unfolds, one thing is certain. The intersection of ambition and ethics in Hollywood has never been more compelling.